All right, well, after that super dramatic entrance, here we are. We're magnet fishing at Ramsey Creek Park. Here's my buddy, Ben. He's going to be magnet fishing with me. Uh, right there, he was telling me about a story about a woman who uh, threw her wedding ring into the lake here off this pier. And uh, that's kind of what we're out here. We're fishing to see if we can uh, maybe bring it up. And uh, right here, it's probably about 10 feet and kind of using a bobbing method up and down. The silt is uh, kind of soft, so the magnet sinks in. Uh, the first item we bring up here is a, uh, a fishing hook, which we find a lot here because a lot of people have fish off here. We got a rusted bolt, a bread tie of all things, and then yet another fishing hook. So we're going to kind of put all our finds on this, uh, this ledge here. And then as we put it on, we'll kind of see what we all get. Um, with the silt being kind of soft, my magnet picks up a lot of uh, grit, so here I was scraping it off. Now I'm back in the water, see what we can pick up. And again, using the bobbing method, it's soft here, so I'm just kind of going up and down to see what I can pick up. Right there, I felt a strong grab, and I felt it clink on, and as you see, we're bringing it up here, a nice uh, gutter nail. Then again, we'll put that on the ledge, and we'll throw her back in to see what we can get. Now we're on the front side of the pier here, and uh, kind of just bobbing across. And this uh, was a nice little drop shot sinker. Now this thing was pretty tough to get off. You can see me struggling a bit and that thing was pretty good and stuck on there. Back in the water, you see Ben over there. He's pulling up his magnet and then pulled up my magnet. Got another fish hook. We'll add it to our collection of fish hooks over here. up again I got a nice little lure there we're gonna add that to our collection and keep on magnet fishing at this point I was almost betting a thousand I was thrown in pulling up thrown in pulling out oh wait hold on a minute we're gonna reverse here so this is Ben's setup here he has a 2x2 two two, 1 inch by Master Magnetics and uh, to show you what he's pulled up before, he was at a park in South Charlotte and he pulled up some scissors, some bottle caps, more fish hooks. And you saw that a uh, fishing reel handle on there, which coincidentally enough that we pulled up here, a nice camo fishing rod handle as well. We'll pop that to our collection and then also another little lure. And we're back in fishing, pulling up. Yeah, got another little tiny fish hook. Oh, make that two fish hooks. And I think actually there was one more fish hook on there. And there it is, pulling that other little fish hook out. So we did a three fish hooks on that catch. Throw it back in. Now we're kind of fishing on the other side of the pier. Coming up, we're probably in about five or six feet of water here. Pulling up, uh, looks like we just got a deck now, probably for when they're building the deck here. Also, we had to be careful when we're throwing in that we didn't get caught on any rocks. There's a lot of rocks down there that could, uh, the magnet could wedge between. So we're uh, throwing them in and trying to avoid them. Here we got a bottle cap. And if I remember correctly, this bottle cap was natural ice. 
we'll add our bottle cap and keep on fishing. Here again, I'm off the front of the pier trying to see, kind of refish where I was. And uh, it amazes me that even though we fish there, we're still catching stuff. So here we got a, uh, another fish hook with a worm, uh, fake worm attached. And also we got some line with it. Then we also got a rusted out bottom of a can. On this one we got like a fish hook with like a little frog attached for bass fishing and then we got another deck nail. This one we got actually a pretty decent fish hook. This thing looked brand new out of the pack. Um, it was in pretty good condition for being down there. Here you can see me swing and I'm trying to swing underneath the pier so that when people drop things the items kind of feather down and maybe kind of land underneath the pier. So putting it under the pier and then bringing it out and kind of just doing the bobbing method again. Bouncing it on the softness of the, the lake on the bottom there. See what we can pull up. and yet another fish hook. So here's our treasure. This is what we found that day. Uh, fish hooks and gutter nails and drop sinkers. Uh, we've got a camo fishing rod. However, we didn't find our treasure we we're looking for, but yet we'll be out another day. Thanks for watching.